Hi Angels, it's Teresa from Tea Sparkles Bright and welcome back. Uh, today I'm going to do a series, I'm going to start a series of uh, paranormal experiences that I have had throughout my life. Uh, I already have a paranormal experience video up. I know some of you angels have watched it. And I mentioned in the video if uh, you would like to see more of these videos and some of you angels said uh, yes you that you would so uh, as I promised I, I said I would do them in October since it's Halloween so um, this little story uh, it's not too long this is a very short story but this is the beginning of when I remembered that I started having these experiences so let's get started Okay, when I was about four or five, it had to be four or five, uh, we lived in this um, house. It was a small two-bedroom house, and this house was a frame house, and it stood up on blocks, so uh, you could go under the house if you wanted to. So, uh, one night, uh, I was in my bed, and uh, I started hearing, like, like knocking up from under the house and yes we did have pets uh, I had two horses I had ducks I had a possum I had cats uh, yeah so I mean anybody could say well it was one of your animals that went up under the house and was knocking you know under the house but uh, no it wasn't because one day it was late evening uh, we're, we're, we're a family, a big family on my mother's side. Uh, and in our neighborhood, it was all of my mom's sisters that lived down the neighborhood. It was like uh, four, one, two, three, five sisters that we all lived like next to each other or across the street from each other. So um, all my cousins, we were always outside playing. Uh, until the late evening, uh, maybe about six, seven o'clock, and uh, we had a garage that was separate from the house. It was a little, you know, back, a little further back from the house, and it was empty. There was really nothing in there, and uh, I remember being outside one day, and I looked into the garage, and I saw uh, a person standing there, and. Uh, I mean, I don't, I don't know how to explain it. I don't know what my thought process was at four or five years old, but I just remember it standing there, and I don't, re I didn't recognize who it was, so I just ran inside, and um, so I kind of forgot about it, and maybe a little later on, I was outside playing again, and I looked in the garage again, and this time there was two figures standing there just looking at me. And this time I did run inside and I told my mom and I told her that there was two people or two figures in the garage looking at me. So she did go outside and she didn't see anything. So that was uh, my first paranormal, paranormal experience. And the second one was uh, I was at the same age, about four or five. And I remember vividly. Uh, I mean, I don't know if I dreamed this. I don't know if I, I don't know, but I'm going to explain it to you. I remember going into this beautiful, beautiful place, and I was in the field of white daisies, beautiful white daisies. It was so bright and vivid. And then all of a sudden, Jesus st just started walking towards me and when he got to me he didn't say anything he just held out his hand so that I could grab it and and I did I grabbed his hand and we just started walking in that beautiful field of daisies and I'll never forget that till the day I die and and I know some people when they die they have experience like experiences like this. They will see things. They will see Jesus. They will see angels. They will see heaven. But I never told my mom about this. Never till maybe, maybe like fifteen years ago. I asked her. I said, "Mom, did 
did I ever die when I was a little girl? And she said, no, what are you talking about? And, and I explained to her what had happened, what, what I saw. And she says, no, you never died. And so uh, to this day, I wonder, you know, why did I see this? I mean, I've never heard of a child to just dream about Jesus. I mean, I have set six grandchildren and none of them have ever come to me and say, Grandma, I dreamed about Jesus last night. So, I mean, I just wonder. I mean, I'm pretty sure I'll get the answer to it one day. But um, those were two of my short little experiences. And uh, I have more and they get uh, better. But I just wanted to experience these two just to grab your attention. And I hope you come back to my next video and found, find out what my next experience paranormal experience is going to be so uh, but that being said thank you so much to all my angels for coming back to support my channel and watch my videos I really really appreciate it so much uh, because without you I wouldn't have gotten as far as uh, I have gotten I can't believe I'm already at uh, 940 angels and I just want to thank you so so much so I sing, send you hugs and kisses. And until my next video, I send you peace and light. And remember to always sparkle bright. Bye.